The B-2 stealth bomber is an impressive piece of equipment, but on February 23, 2008, the Spirit of Kansas 89-0127 became the first of its kind to spectacularly crash just moments after taking off outside Guam. The U.S. Air Force bomber had already logged over 5,100 flight hours when it was suddenly brought down over the runway, but the state-of-the-art warplane might not have ended up a fiery wreck had it been for one simple fix. Reports found that the cause of the crash was a few drops of rainwater in three of the 24 air pressure sensors that feed data to the flight control system, which distorted the plane's positioning. Once the moisture evaporated, the crew's recalibrated sensors were providing false data on airspeed and pressure, which measure altitude causing the aircraft to stall. During previous B-2 deployments to humid Guam where planes are mostly stored outside, maintenance personnel had reportedly used an unofficial fix by turning on the heat and boiling off moisture before calibration. If this bootleg procedure had been widely communicated, the first crash in the stealth bomber's 19-year flying history might have been avoided. Thankfully, the two pilots ejected in time, but the $1.4 billion warplane was reduced to scrap metal in minutes, making this one costly human error.